So this video I'm about to share is actually something happened in my town. I was recently let it where that happened about two weeks ago, roughly. Um, the original owner of this content is uh, The Adventures of Yeti and MJ. So um, if you have any issues with it, let me know. But I'm giving you guys full credit to this video. Uh, but I just thought I should share this and let other people know that this stuff is going down. Still, I mean, granted, the situation's a little bit different. They didn't know what the fuck they're walking into. Uh, but a sense of force, I feel, is definitely there, and they have something. So if you guys are watching this, feel free to reach out to me. Um, I'm, I live in the city of Kakana. Also, I am also battling them in court right now for this same type of fucking shit and not being able to record them out in public places and... I mean, I think it's amazing that all suddenly one of their officers has a body camera, which is absolutely amazing because I wonder, I wonder who pushed them to that edge. Hmm, let's think about that. Dude, 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 what, what did he do? What did he do? I want to know what you're detaining him for right now. That's the law. That's the law. That's the law. Tell me your badge number, your badge number, and who the hell did this? Why don't you have your badge numbers? I want to know them. I want to know them both. I want to know them both right now, right now. That's the law. I also want to know why you're detaining my brother right now, right now. Tell him to stop. Right now. Exactly. I heard it. He opened the door. He tried to break it. Stop it. Stop it. Look at me. Stop it. I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay, just stop. This is the problem. This is the fucking problem. I'm supposed to back blue when you're gonna enter my home. Why? Why am I being Because of a call. That's okay for you. Then explain to me Stop. why you Stop! My name is Tiki Leonard! I got you! Fuck you, dude! Fuck you! Who called you? I don't We don't know! For the third time! Ask me one more question, dude! Dude, relax! No, you guys should relax! You guys did this! Yeah, you just broke an entry of a house! You have not given me your bad number! You have not told me the reason why he's being detained! You have not done one thing! I could be detained! That's fine! You wanna put me on the ground like a little kid, too? You're gonna feel like a big guy? Why are you so amped up? Because you oh, broke into my house just now. You just opened it. That doesn't mean you opened the door. Yes, it does. No, it does not. Yes, it no, does. No, it does not. Only if you yes, would. Only, it only does. I know my rights. You say what then, you will. Then why don't you. Your right to remain silent. How's that? I'll exercise this right all day. There'll be lawyers on this. Michelle, no. Exercise your right to remain silent. No, that's right. That's what you do. That's what you do. That's what you do. What you, do. you don't listen to these people. Don't. No, don't. I'm telling you, don't. Right to remain silent. Shut up. Oh, so kiss my ass. Freedom of speech. Just if, let them handle it. That's exactly what it is. Cool. We're going to detain you and you're going to go in my car. Speech, guys. It's okay. We need to figure out what's okay. going on here. Okay. So if you just stop yelling okay. and okay. screaming, okay. we're going to figure this out. Okay. I want to understand too. That's why okay. I'm just confused. We got called. Just listen to me. Okay. All right. Deep breath. Okay. We got called because we were told, I can show you on my screen. Yes. We got called because there were there was a female and a male shoving and yelling at each other here. Okay. No one was shoving. Just listen. Just listen. Okay. 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 What's your name? My name. That's not important right now. I want to know the what's story. What's his name? Yeti. Yeti? No, my name is Coven. Coven? Yeah. Okay, Coven. We got called here for a disturbance. Okay. A female and a male yelling and shoving each other. I understand. There was okay. no shoving. There was no there was shoving. And that's all we wanted right. to determine. And I would have been fine with but that. Why are you he, arresting me? He came out. I walked out of my Josh! house. Josh! Oh, stop! Just five minutes! Key, and I want to know. I want to know. Okay, then I want to know. Then I want to know. Because I want to know. I want to know their point then. I know what your point is. So, well, you'll talk to him in a minute. And I know his point because I know my brother follows the law. Well, what happened was he got hostile with it immediately. The dogs are running around here. I want to find out who's... And can I explain that? Just One second. Can I explain that? Yes. Just, my sister used to live here, and the neighbors around here have called the police on my sister multiple times. Because of the dogs? No, there's a lot of... I'm sure oh, my sister has a whole record. I'm okay. sure my sister has a whole record. But we just came here. We just got here maybe a couple weeks ago to start watching her kids, and then she moved to Florida. So she left with all of her things. So we've been doing busting our butt here. And the neighbors, some of them are giving us respect, but some of them obviously don't talk to us still probably because of the past tenants, which is understandable. 
But I'm assuming that they heard us yelling because we were fighting, yeah. us two, okay. not and shoving. That's, that's all we were Not shoving. For. And that's fine. And I would have told you that. Fine. That, that is fine by me. But I promise you, I promise you, the, the people here probably called the police because they heard us yelling. And that's probably what happened. Just pushing and shoving, that was probably all just made up to make sure that you guys came here. And it might be. And, and here you guys are, and that's fine. And, and it I'm might fine be, but when we, when we making show sure up, that you know that that's okay. And everyone is breathing fire, screaming and yelling him. He's yelling. Because I'm scared. I'm scared. That's but, my little brother. He has a listen, bad broken listen, wrist. A plate with do, 15 screws. But what we Very need easy to, do, to break. Five pounds okay. of pressure. The doctor just told him. That's way more than five pounds. Okay. They break his arm. I'll Lay fucking go to jail every day of the week. Every day of the week. Guys! 100 pounds. Each. She... Just listen to her, will I you please? I weigh 100 pounds. Will Come you listen to her? Can you listen to me? No, you won't. I'm not this? even talking to you. Guys, please! Five so listen. Just let me handle it, please! I so, the reason I opened the door is because... We're, you don't know if she's beat or hurt in there. Yes. You want to come in there. Absolutely. Understand that. And, but you don't. And, and your brother is being incredibly hostile. hostile. Right. And you would think so we, that he could have been the male. So we don't okay. know. I understand if now. She is in there getting her ass kicked. Okay, or she already is. Or you are. The one that did it. Okay. okay. I absolutely understand. I, we, I didn't even know if anyone was in there. Okay. I was upstairs. We were both upstairs. That's why we didn't hear you right away. And when I heard the door pounding, I was like, bet you that's the cops because we've been yelling really loud. Yeah. And when I came down here and I saw you open the door, that's when I saw Keegan already get getting tackled. And that's when it's like, oh my God, what is, I didn't even know. I was just sitting here fighting with my girlfriend for two seconds and all of a sudden I'm coming down here getting, cops are opening my door, my brother's getting thrown to the ground and see how overwhelming that becomes so fast. Yeah, but and the thing is, so okay, arm, when we don't understand what's you. going on, That's when you turn okay, and, and he's being super hostile. I totally understand. I was talking to you. Like I didn't know what was going on behind you. Never whip someone like that. Just that is a rap. Did that's you tell him to stop? That's illegal. He, he, he doesn't. That is so illegal. we get it. Like you can't just grab pe someone. People. No. Keegan, hey, Keegan, take a breath. Keegan, take a breath. I see your leg shaking. Take a fucking breath. We just want to stay with him. He's all right. He okay, just like that. now with regards to the, the disturbance. To what's your name again? Michelle. Michelle. We have to just Do determine what's I'm going, going on. It's, it was and, just a and if people are just yelling at each other, that's fine. That happens. Can I explain that part? You absolutely. Go ahead. Okay, we were yelling. Yeah. And I will take full responsibility. He was trying to talk to me, and I was not listening. Mm -hmm. I have... No. Admittedly, anger issues and depression and some other stuff. And it can, the yelling can get very loud. And he's been trying to tell me, I need to calm down because otherwise, this is what's going to happen. Do you guys all live here? No, we don't technically live here because we're not on the lease. We okay. live in our vans and vehicles. But you guys have been staying here, though. Right, right. Okay. in the driveway because we have permission from my sister to get rid of all of her things that was left here when she moved. Okay. And just make sure the house is clean by the time just so we you guys leave. know, if if this wouldn't have happened, we would have talked to you and you. You would have told me that. You would have told me that. Would we would have left. You you would have, have already been in the house, do. officer. I, I all due respect. All due respect, officer. You came in the house. That all that would have went away the moment you opened that no, door. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. And, you came in the just, house, and that's I'll, scary to me because I don't know who you are. And then you just open the door and come to my house. I'm gonna be terrified. Remember? Yeah, but I'm not gonna, dude. You're opening the door. I'm, I'm, I know you need a warrant for that. I know you need a warrant for that. Whether there's reason to believe or not. Okay. Guys, guys, you do, and that's exactly right. Stop. You need a warrant. It's called exigent circumstances. Yes. Look it up. Okay. Look it up. And that would be a very, very frugal court term. And you know it, and I know it. Exactly. Just when this is all over, you need to convince them of that. I want to ask you a question. Are we arresting him? I'd love to see Because that's going to calm him down a ton. If you arrest him, that's pretty sure. He needs to calm down. I know that, and I agree. I agree. Because when when this is what happens when people approach us like that. I know, and he's just scared. And like you were. But, okay, can I just give you one, yes. one second to please understand my side? Absolutely. Okay, because I know that's a, uh, this is a lot to ask for from a police officer. All, I, all I'm saying is we've had run-ins with the law multiple times where people just jump to the worst things. And when you're when you're pulled out of a car, you're asked 50 million questions, and you have to answer them correctly. When you're when I, I, Last year, I got punched in the face by my sister, and both of us were bleeding. The police came here and gave us tickets, not her. Gave us tickets. We've been in the position where we've wanted the people that have the badge to help us, and they have not. They have done the exact opposite. So you have to understand when he sees... He sees this thing. He sees a bunch of police driving. officers. He doesn't know that you're a good person behind the badge. Like he doesn't know that. He's going to just think, think every single person that has been a police officer has Don't fucked come. our lives up. A tremendous amount. When they could have just denied it or turned the other head. But they have not done that. And that is, it's, it's exactly my point. That's exactly why he's acting so hostile. And I well, just want to understand. That, that doesn't make any... The, the, the issue is when you guys have questions, 
there's a lot more behind our answers. There's legality Absolutely. issues, like the exigent circumstances I'm talk, telling him about. That's why I can open the door. Because if he's out here hostile with my partner, and I think you're in there getting your ass kicked. Oh my God, you never just realized it. But on the video I just uploaded about the sleeping DOT guy, the state trooper, that's actually him. That is him in here that I'm gonna snag in. So go check out that other video I got going on. Thanks. Yo! I understand that. I am, I, you, were, you, you were nothing but hostile, okay? So just stop. So if I think you're getting your ass kicked in there, we're going in. Absolutely. That's called exigent circumstances okay, that I don't I just, need I a warrant for. I just need a heard it Perfect. From him, so, so remember that. So that, cut the that's shit. why. You want to go to jail? Cut no. the shit. Well, you're acting they like that, like you're a big hard ass dude. They ripped me to the ground. I told them no, and you ripped me to the ground. Because so. they got a call that someone was getting beat here. What do you think they're going to do? You mean to get my ID? That's also, you don't need that. Well, yeah, they would if they think that you're the one beating her. Come on, Keegan. If you were a cop, you'd be doing the same shit. Come on, understand where they're coming from too. So, anyways, you guys are okay. Yes. Yes. You guys are boyfriend girlfriend. Yes, and we were never pushing. And you guys never laid no. hands, no. just yelling at each other. Okay. Can I talk to you privately, you. Michelle? Just on the back side of the van over here. And just so you know, we're recording everything too. I know. Right? I know. That doesn't mean those get deleted and don't get deleted. Yeah. Dude was yelling at me to put my dog back in the car. In Keegan's defense as well, he also didn't even know we were really fighting inside. So, I mean, like, he really didn't know what was going on. He just heard we were yelling. So, I mean, he really wasn't involved. With my dogs when they're going to the bathroom? Hey, we don't know. You can just be quiet now. And if we get here and figure out, okay, this gentleman isn't involved, I hope you know two guys picked me up and threw me to the ground. But until we figure out exactly what is going on, we have to do I think the only abuse that went around here was what I saw from them. They picked me up and threw me to the ground. I know you weren't, but then watch their body cams because that's harassment. All they asked was for my ID. All I did was walk away to go get the two people inside because I didn't know they could walk inside. I would have just went and grabbed the people and that would have been it. But no, this guy wants to pick me up. Yeah, Keegan, his face is red because he knows he did wrong too. Calm down. I can only hold five pounds. He backs it backwards like this. Like this, dude. I was already in so much danger. You don't understand. He did nothing. He did nothing. Yeah, and we still haven't gotten either of their badge numbers, Keegan, no, or any reason not. why they would have tackled you. So here's the thing. I don't understand any of this. Look at his nose, dude. It's running. Come on. Get him a little tissue or something. I got one right here, but I don't want to approach you guys and then you kill me. Nope. I can't do it. If you got thrown down into the ground and put in handcuffs and asked a million questions, would you be nice to them? Come on, man. Don't even say dumb things. Yeah, but I, yeah, but would you be nice if they threw you onto the ground and then just wanted to talk to you, some other guy? Come on, you're going to still be upset that they threw you to the ground. Be realistic. Let's just all just be quiet, because we all know that that's the only thing that's really going to help.
five quad cars. Take it to court, Keegan. Take it to court. Take it to court. You can't even argue with them. Good. And then this will be there too. Look at your neck, dude. Holy shit. Yeah, you were resisting, all right. 110 pounds on two guys, 300 pounds. Oh my god. I can't believe that you would even say that. I watched it happen. Resist. You threw him to the ground with two people pulling his arms and legs. How could one resist? Oh my god. Yeah, I can't. Jesus fuck. This is my exact example. What's your example? What do you mean? Every single time you guys have to cite every single person for one person that didn't even do anything but want to start defending himself for a bunch of officers rolling up and he didn't even understand. See, but we don't either. That's the problem. I understand, but why did he have to get ticketed? Are you guys getting ticketed for not understanding? No. So why does he have... You don't realize we're all both broke living in vehicles. You want to take more money from people that don't have anything. That's why I just don't understand. How are you supposed to be the good people? I don't understand that. I have no money. He has no money. You still want to ticket us for getting upset that we didn't understand change was going on. You want to give us more tickets? We have no money. When I'm going to go to jail when, if I don't pay my tickets. When can I answer? Okay. The psycho here must be better than this.